Hi, good morning. Uh, welcome to the Collar Project Update for the Rookie Release. Uh, I'm Eduardo of Stack Collar PTL, my friend Surya, and let's go to the, what's new in the new release. First, first of all, what's Collar? Collar provides a production container ready for and deployment tools to pair in OpenStack deployments. Uh, the project is composed of three sub-projects, OpenStack Cola, which is Docker images and building tools. Uh, Cola Ansible, which is the deployment tool based in Ansible playbooks to deploy OpenStack. And Cola CLI, uh, command line interface and API to configure and deploy Cola Ansible environments. Uh, the project history, uh, it was founded through the Kilo release. And then uh, one release later, during the big 10, during the liquidity cycle. And now, with Rocky, we're in the seven stable release. Uh, and the latest uh, user survey, we increased uh, a lot of production environments. Uh, 115 production environments with color Ansible. And 25 only the Docker images we produce with Puppet, Nomad, and other deployment tools. Uh, just a bit a small note. Uh, these deployments are only from the English English language, so all the Chinese are not uh, translated to English yet. So probably it's going to be much more deployments for this release. Uh, for the color images, we have added uh, eight new Docker images for Logstash, Monasca, Prometheus, DraftD, Neutron Infolux, Ipan Driver, and Apache Storm. We also have. Uh, support for blue store in Ceph clusters, uh, which we support both um, blue store and legacy storage file systems. Uh, and the Colabil scripts we also support now network mode, so you can define if you want to use NAT or NetHost for image building. Uh, we also have decreased the size of the images a bit. Uh, by removing documentation from the packages and, and not using packages in the new releases. And also, we now include security updates for every package we, we install. Uh, the Ubuntu West images have been upgraded to Bionic release. And we have added, added new Neutron drivers into the Neutron images, like uh, networking Ansible and networking Barometer. Now, in this release, we finally have published the images to Docker Hub. So you can just pull the images, and you don't have to build images every time you, you want to deploy OpenStack with Cola and Ansible. Uh, those images are runs a CI job before pushing to Docker Hub. So all the images are less built, and the core services are tested before run, pushing to Docker Hub. Uh, are daily builds? and also includes the latest security update for the, for the packages. For the future, in the Cola images, we aim to optimize a bit more the, the images to decrease the size and remove all these packages. We also planning to migrate to Python 3. Uh, this is not going to be soon, because many OpenStack projects doesn't support Python 3 yet, and there is also no OpenStack uh, uh, distribution supporting Python 3 yet. CentOS is not supporting, so we cannot move over everything to Python yet, to Python 3 yet. Uh, we aim to provide more CI jobs for the images before pushing to Docker Hub, so we ensure more open, more services are tested before having the images of seen for consuming. Uh, we also aim to provide more CI jobs for for third-party tools or for Cola images users like Triple O and OpenStack Helm. Uh, we need volunteers to do this job. Triple O is now has already put a, a patch for this, so they are just testing the images. And more CI jobs for pushing the images. Hello, everyone. So uh, what updates we have uh, from Cola and Civil side? So uh, in Rocky, we uh, supported the safe uh, Blue Store SD. And, uh, by default, we are uh, supporting for now the OSG types only. Uh, maybe future, we other uh, types of the storage will be uh, supported by the SAP itself. And uh, some of the new roles uh, for the OpenStack services uh, is uh, added in Rocky, like uh, Freezer Scheduler, uh, uh, and uh, Apache Kafka, Apache Zookeeper, and Partial Momonaska is, uh, for now, it is done. But uh, in uh, Rocky, we uh, supported a partial one. 
So, um, and we talk about the zero downtime upgrade. So, uh, in uh, pretty much stable sta uh, stage, we uh, have uh, uh, for the Glance service, Cinder, and um, Ironic, and some of the more uh, core services is in uh, implemented for, for the stain one, uh, like Neutron, uh, Nova, and uh, Swift. So, uh, but uh, in Rocky updates, we have these three uh, stables one. And if you talk about the monitoring uh, for the uh, open source tool for the monitoring uh, purpose, so we supported uh, the uh, in Rocky Prometheus, uh, which is very much popular uh, as a open source tool. So uh, we have the role for uh, Prometheus one too. And now you can. Uh, restrict the limits on the container image with the help of Kula uh, uh, Ansible rules so, uh, at the runtime. So uh, you can uh, restrict your resources uh, up to a limit uh, uh, option uh, provided by the Kula Ansible script. And we also have uh, now developed uh, to the providing the developer option for uh, um, OpenStack core services to create your uh, own development environment uh, into containers itself with the help of Kola Ansible script. Now, the, some of the changes that we uh, did in Rocky in the Neutron. So uh, you can uh, see the like uh, ML2 plugin. You can uh, have OpenVC, Linux Beach, or Hyper-V L2 agent. So you can now customize uh, with Kola uh, Ansible script uh, for the Neutron service. And if you talk about the info blocks, uh, IPM driver, so uh, it's used for the Neutron subproject uh, intercommunication. So you can configure the driver uh, of the info blocks in, in Neutron, Cola, and Sybil uh, roles itself. And uh, open networking operating system is also supported. Uh, so here you uh, can uh, uh, with the, do with the Cola and Sybil script also. And uh, networking bare metal is also uh, comes into feature, which is the same as supported by the Neutron project. And uh, you can uh, do the some user uh, local setting for the Horizon project itself that uh, enables you to debug some of the JavaScript and CSS uh, level uh, codes in the Horizon itself. And uh, we also added some of the more options in the Cola and Sybil uh, CLI. So it is uh, like a fork, a check, and diff. Uh, with the fork, we uh, added for the large uh, amount of deployments. So it makes sense uh, adding the fork and uh, doing the fork for the Ansible module. And for the check, we uh, added this option with the Cola script to uh, run to run your uh, mock mock test after the post deployment. As we already did the uh, in the pre check uh, before deployment of the Cola with uh, Cola Ansible. So with the check, we can, uh, you can run your uh, mock test after the post deployment. And if you talk about the like, uh, what is the future of the Cola Ansible? So we uh, we are targeting these are the features that we'll be targeting for a stain or a train cycle. So fast forward update is a uh, priority one that we are looking for the next release, and a zero downtime upgrade for the all uh, core services as well as some of the supporting services of the OpenStack. And uh, CI improvements is very needed for uh, these uh, de uh, deployment techniques and features uh, in the field of uh, upgrades, uh, as well as some non-core projects, uh, deployments, and running the functional test uh, in the CI itself. And we can use like uh, Rally, RefStack, and uh, Tempest uh, to automate the, our testing in uh, GetJob. And uh, we are also targeting uh, database backup recovery, uh, restoring tool with the help of Cola Ansible, some when your control base and database downs, and how uh, Cola Ansible will cope up with that. And uh, Cola uh, uh, dashboard uh, is one of the features that you can expect, uh, and which is uh, we'll be doing the POC for now. So that is uh, for a very good interface to get the deployment uh, with the help of Cola Ansible. Now, our community is uh, no vendors, no single vendor community. So we have a lot of diversity, and no company owns more than 20 percent of the contributions. We are the global distributed community with many contributors from Asia, Europe, and the US. Uh, in the Rocky release, we have 125 contributors, 
contributing code to Colantial and almost 160 uh, reviewers with nearly 5,000 reviews and rookie release. Uh, we have uh, 720 commits doing rookie release. 18% uh, is done by other contributors, which is, means no single company owns the code, so it's a good number to, to know. Uh, if you want to join the team, uh, our IC channel is OpenStack Cola and Free Node Network. Uh, meeting to see that OpenStack Meeting 4 on Wednesdays, 15 UTC. Uh, you can ask anything at the mailing list with Cola attacks. And books, reviews, and patches are welcome. Filtered by waitlist in Easy Physics and at Launchpad. So you can start with Fast and Easy Fix to start contributing into Cola. And uh, thanks to all the contributors who made this release possible. Uh, thank you for coming. <laughs> any, any questions so far? Any questions? Easy. <laughs> Thank you.